Welcome back to the channel. My name's Alex Lokes, and today we are in Burlington, Ontario. The birds are nice, the sky is perfect. It's the perfect day to shoot my last roll, and ironically my second roll, a Fuji Pro 400H. Earlier this year, Fujifilm announced that they would be discontinuing it, and a lot of people within the film photography community bemoan the loss of this, but I mean, it's really par for the course for Fuji. So I thought about it and went, hmm, I wonder if I've ever shot the stuff. So I went back through my vast film holdings and uh, realized that I'd never shot the stuff. So I was at Burlington Camera one day and they happened to have a uh, handful of pro packs left of the stuff. And with everyone else on uh, eBay and stuff hoarding and price gouging, you know, the price wasn't bad for, uh, for it. $17 a roll, I mean, that's the same stuff, same cost as Portra. I decided to buy two rolls and here we are. So let's get walking. I have my uh, Roloflex 2.8F out, just got my uh, second and uh, final roll loaded. I got the first roll I shot earlier in the bag so I can drop everything off at Burlington Camera after I'm done. All right, let's get going. You know, the, the first film I remember them actually canceling is Kodachrome. It was right at the beginning of my journey into film photography, and I learned about it from the FPP. And I immediately went out, got as much Kodachrome as I could, and shot it, and loved it. So, yeah, it, it sucked. But, honestly, I don't shoot a lot of color film, so... What's there to miss with Pro 400H? I really hope I don't get the same thing I got with Kodachrome with uh, 400H. If not, I'll have to go buy the rest of the stuff from Burlington Camera. That's probably not the best idea. Let's keep walking. Thank you. 
seeing your favorite film get cut sucks. I'll admit it, I'd be gutted if Kodak ended Tri-X. But we just don't have a buying power of the community. We cannot buy enough film to convince a multinational manufacturing firm to continue with something that's just not pulling its profit. The one thing we can control, however, is how we react. We can bitch, moan, and complain all we want, but that really will only drive someone away if the community's filled with people who just complaining about the good old days. The community I know is friendly, welcoming, open to new things. So, next time a film gets cut, move on to the next one. Because eventually, everything dies. Mm -hmm.